And now I return the microphone to Leslie Catherwood to recognize our outgoing board members. I'm back already. Um, but unfortunately, for four wonderful board members, their terms end tonight. And I would like to take a moment to recognize each of them for their tremendous service to ANS. Unfortunately, the first person um, I was going to mention is an, unable to be here tonight. Alan Feingold um, brought her amazing analytical talents to the ANS board for the past three years, and she will be greatly missed. But I do actually want to give a special shout out to my fellow board class members. We joined the board together six years ago as a massive class of seven people. And there are four of us who remained with ANS um, through to the end for a full six years. And first, I would like to acknowledge my partner in crime as the vice president of the board, Paul. Paul previously served as the treasurer and finance committee chair. Yeah. So as I said, Paul has previously served as the treasurer and the finance committee chair before he even agreed to serve as vice president. Um, his talent in financial and cost analysis, contract negotiation, revenue generation, and business acumen has made his service on multiple committees all the more valuable. He has served on the environmental education, development, finance, master plan, and strategic plan committees. I would also like to note that Paul's two children regularly participate in Audubon education programs and have attended summer camps here at Woodend. In addition, Paul and his son Gabriel enthusiastically participate in the ANS Birdathon each year, raising both money and Paul's bird IQ. <laughs> so. I would also like to acknowledge Mike Gravitz, who we have already uh, heard a little bit about this evening. Mike brought his passion for conservation advocacy to ANS by helping lead the coalition that successfully fought to save 10 Mile Creek, as we now all know. Mike is actually the one that coined the Save 10 Mile Creek battle cry, go, fight, win. <laughs> and he has carried that enthusiasm and commitment onto his work on our programs committee and Mike was actually previously chair of our conservation committee. Mike. And unfortunately, our fourth and final board member rolling off tonight, Jen Henricks, also couldn't be here this evening. Um, but Jen is our communications guru. Um, as such, she previously chaired the communications committee and you can see her deep influence in the communications realm in our gorgeously new, des newly designed websites, plus our beautiful new ANS brand, which you see here on the t-shirt. Most recently, Jen chaired the development, development committee for ANS, helping us to prepare the organization for growth in the years ahead. So I would like to ask that Paul and Mike please join me here to up at the podium to be recognized. Thank you so much. For 